Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. So yesterday we were in Berlin because Dungin had some work to do there. And since the 15th January was the launch date of the Connect BTS in Berlin, I decided to tag along and visit the exhibition. Bikit actually left us in the dark for quite a while after announcing the Connect events for each city. We all didn't know what it was and we weren't even given a time. And since London was first scheduled on 14th of January, London armies were speculating about the time it will start. The dates were announced in KST, so they already assembled a day earlier at Piccadilly Circus and waited without even knowing what to wait for. To be fair to London armies, I also booked my tickets to Berlin without even knowing anything about the event or being sure about the time. So if I had been in London at the time, I would have been clowning alongside you guys for sure. Anyways, for those of you who still don't know what Connect BTS is, to give you an overview, there are various exhibitions in five cities, London, Berlin, Buenos Aires, Seoul and New York. They are put together by different curators who resonated with BTS philosophy. And the ultimate goal of this project is to connect individuals across the world as they reevaluate their present circumstances, attitudes and potentialities. As far as I know, the exhibitions are free. I put you the link to the Connect BTS page down below so you can get all the information about the dates, times and location. So we left for Berlin early in the morning, starting from Frankfurt Airport. And we actually almost missed our flights because I was tested positive for explosives. So I had to be questioned by the police and in the end we never found out what it was, but Anyway, we eventually made it on our flight and we arrived in Berlin. Berlin is actually internationally well known for being a very artsy city. After some snacks and coffee, we went to the Gopius Bau Gallery, where the exhibition is taking place until 2nd February. And from a trusted news source, I found out that the actual program starts a day after, but we went there anyways to have a quick peek at the gallery. I probably wouldn't be able to film the actual performances anyways, but maybe there will be some official videos of the performances online afterwards. BTS actually interviewed the individual curators about the project and you can watch all the videos on the website down below. <coughs> <sighs> The Connect BTS project in Berlin is called Rituals of Care and it's curated by Stephanie Rosenthal and Noemi Solomon. On the homepage of the gallery you can find some detailed information about it. Okay, so the description says the performance program spans experimental choreography, healing practices, sonic installations and collective gatherings through a range of somatic techniques, queer reimaginings and indigenous perspectives. These performances offer radical acts of care and repair. That sounds really deep and interesting actually. So the only exhibit that was already there was the left-right stereo installation by Chef Dead Eric in the foyer. It features the artist's own sound system from his high school years, which I personally found really special. I hope you guys get to see one of the exhibits near your city. I'm sure it will definitely be worth it because learning something new and seeing different perspectives can never go wrong. Afterwards, we went to Berlin Charlottenburg where we wanted to grab some Korean street style food which was highly recommended to me by locals and on our way we stumbled upon a really cute small store for k-pop and anime merchandise the street food store was called Son kitchen which means hand kitchen and they sell all kinds of korean flavor infused street food starting from kimchi burgers to deep fried kimchi fried rice balls there's actually lots of great korean foods in berlin so if you're there you should definitely try some and that's it already for today's video i know it was short but i wanted to at least give you a little glimpse of the Connect BTS project. I think it's such a wonderful thing how BTS brings together art and music and really connects people through it. So thank you guys for watching as always and I see you guys in the next video.